So here's how you make an IQ test. It's really easy, and everyone should know this, because you need, you need to know how these things work. So imagine that you took a universal library of questions, any sort of question, that required abstraction to solve. It could be a general knowledge question, it could be a vocabulary question, it could be a mathematical question. It doesn't matter. It could be a question about anything, as long as it requires abstraction to solve. So you have a universal library of those questions. Then imagine you took a hundred questions at random from that universal library and you gave them to 500 people, and then you just totaled their scores, right? Right, wrong, totaled, totaled their scores. Then you rank ordered the scores from highest performer to lowest performer. That's IQ, that's all there is to it, that's it. And then what you'd find is if you took another 100 questions from the same library, randomly selected, and gave them to the same 500 people, then you'd have two rank orders, right? From, from the top to the bottom. The correlation between the two rank orders would be about 0.9 unbelievably high, it's unbelievably stable. 